Danny Hanks here with Colin Inc. helping people do their business better. And today we have a good one. We have a viewer request who wants to see or hear the Evolve 285 versus the Evolve 275 uh, from Jabra. And so that's what we're gonna do. But first, let's do a quick similarities, differences. Uh, let's jump into that right now. <laughs> All right, so starting with the Evolve 275, the MSRP is $349 to $399, so you can get the headset by itself, or you can get the charging stand, two-year warranty, dual headband, connectivity out of the box, uh, you can connect to a computer via the Link380 dongle, either USB-A or USB-C, and you can connect to a mobile device via Bluetooth. You get up to 30 meters or 100 foot range, and you know, we all know about that you get up to 36 hours, and this is the battery life, so you get up to 36 hours with the ANC off, up to 33 hours with ANC on, and talk time you get up to 24 hours. But anyway, so it does have ANC, uh, and this is one of the reasons why people like to get these headsets, so in addition to being able to be heard, they want to be able to hear, and so they want to focus and they turn on the ANC to block out any uh, distracting uh, background noise. So now let's get into the Evolve 285. These come in at an MSRP of $429 with the headset and the dongle, or $499 with the headset and the charging stand. Uh, out of the box, similar connectivity, uh, and again, similar range, up to 30 meters, 100 foot range. The slight uh, differences here, so in the battery life, you get up to 37 hours with ANC off and up to 32 hours with ANC on. Uh, talk time, you get up to 26 hours with ANC and busy light off. But anyway, it's got, again, digital hybrid ANC, but you guys are here to see which one of these microphones sounds better. We include links to these products and to other useful information in the description box below, so make sure to, to check out the description box. There's a ton of links, uh, and even my own personal uh, LinkedIn profile if you want to follow or connect with me on LinkedIn. Uh, you're more than welcome to. So now let's just get these two set up and let's get them tested so you guys can hear for yourselves which one of these two performs better or if they're comparable. Stay tuned. All right, so first up is the Evolve 285. And so let's start out with first some, uh, you know, office background noise. All right, so right now we are using the Evolve to um, I'm going to go ahead and shut up for a little bit. Phone. All right, so let's do the old blender test, right? So one of the things that I noticed, though, is that when it comes to the blender, it's actually louder when I don't have anything in it. When I have stuff in it, it, it tends to uh, suppress the, the noise level a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and, and run it without anything in it. So I'm going to go ahead and start up the blender here. decibels so i'm gonna stand right in front of this uh vitamix here so this is the jabra evolve 285 running blender that's uh extremely loud you can see that it's 90 uh decibels there so it's really loud all right and let's do some uh some barking dogs <laughs> All right, so you can see there that the decibel reader uh, is sometimes up higher than uh, 100 decibels. But this is the Jack Evolve 285. Um, so All right, so we had a little technical difficulty uh, with the television there. I rebooted it, um, and so now we have uh, that going on here. And let's. Uh... All right, so now it's like really loud. So this is the Jabra Evolve. The percentage is considerably higher than past polls dating back more than two decades. This is what it would sound like uh, if you were having a conversation uh, with someone uh, and you had this loud of a TV going on. Justified. Uh, I, I highly unlikely that you'd be in this scenario, but again, we're just doing extreme tests. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and lower that volume. And so now we're going to use, uh, set up the Evolve 275. Let's uh, get that set up. All right, so I'm back. I have the Jabra Evolve 275, and I'm using the same 
uh, Link 380 USB dongle. Uh, so let's start out with some uh, office background noise. Let's see what's going on. Team 75 uh, up against uh, office background noise. But anyway, so here we have the blender. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. And again, I don't have anything in it because it, for me, it was louder without anything in it. All right, ready? So here we go. Uh, standing right in front of a blender running at max uh, speed or, or max power. Uh, again, the Jabra Evolve 275 up against a running blender. Uh, if you're working from home, and this is happening in the background. Who let the dogs out? Let's get some dogs barking up in this mofo. Jabber Evolve 2, 75, with some dogs barking in the background, and as you can see, sometimes it does 100 decibels. Um, all right, so now let's get into this television, and again, this is a very common occurrence if you are working remotely or working from home, and you know you or your significant others watching some TV in the background. You know you're keeping up with the with the news or what's going on in the world around you. All right, so that is extremely loud. Uh, again, anything above 85. Speed, over 99.9% network reliability. 49.99 for 200 megabit. And so this is what it would sound like if you were using the Jabra Evolve 275. All right, so first up is the Evolve 285. All right, so I'm back. I have the Jabra Evolve 275. All right, so right now we are using the Evolve 285 and we have background noise playing. All right, so we have the Jabra Evolve 275 uh, up against uh, office background noise. So this is the Jabra Evolve 285 in front of a running blender. Jabra Evolve 275. Uh, Standing right in front of a blender. The Jabra Evolve 285. Um, Jabra Evolve 275 with some dogs barking in the background. This is the Jabra Evolve 285 with an extremely loud television. Jabra Evolve 275 with an extremely loud television playing in the background. All right. So there you have it. A lot of folks have been uh, commenting that the OG uh, Evolve 75 actually sounds better than all of these. I'm not going to disagree. But in terms of the fit, in terms of the active noise canceling, in terms of the speaker audio quality that you get from these newer variants, it's m greatly improved. Greatly improved over the, the OG Evolve 75. But yes, that microphone was a beast. But if you like this type of video uh, and you want to learn more about which headsets, which audio devices, which video devices are best for you and your business. Uh, feel free to reach out to us. All our contact information is in the description box below. Please like, please subscribe. We had a banner year uh, in 2021 in terms of views, in terms of uh, people just watching our videos, which is fantastic. Thank you so much. We had over like 1.4 million views, which exceeded the views in 2020. We'll keep doing this. There's some new stuff that's coming out. Stay tuned for upcoming uh solutions uh being provided by the wonderful folks over at like jabra and others but again please subscribe click that notification bell so you get notified immediately as we put out new videos thank you